Welcome back to Living 808. Let me start by saying there is a program that you can take at Kapilani Community College that is tuition free. Free. This is a brand free. new program that offers accelerated healthcare training, and we wanted to know more. Kapilani Community College has a new program, and it is tuition free. Did I get your attention? Well, good, because that's a great time to bring in Marcus Fixie, and he is with. KCC, thank you so much for being with us on Living 808. I appreciate it. Thanks for having me on. I'm really excited to uh, tell the people more about this program. And there you have it. Go ahead and do it. Tell us about this program. Um, and I said tuition free. There's a catch. You can explain. That's right. So this program is funded through a federal grant from the office of department, the office of the Department of Labor. And so the caveat is, because they are the Department of Labor, they're trying to help get people into the workplace. So this program pays for tuition for certain healthcare programs as long as you're willing to commit to accepting a position in the field that you train for as soon as you finish. So that may sound a little confusing. So the way that it basically works is there are seven programs, medical assistant, nurse assistant, pharmacy technician, optometry assistant, phlebotomy technician, community health worker, and dental assistant. And so if you're interested in working in one of those fields, we can offer training tuition free, offered mostly online, um, and then you just will be placed into a position in, in that those high demand fields right after. I think that's super exciting, and uh, it would be hard to say that this is not for uh, quite a number of people, but I would like to know who benefits from this program exactly. Yeah, great question. So we created this program as a response to the huge numbers of unemployed and underemployed people that we're seeing um, right now. As we all know, I don't think there's anyone out there who doesn't know someone whose uh, job hasn't been affected by the current situation right now. So this is absolutely in response to that, to try to help those who are either experiencing unemployment or underemployment, or who are realizing that based on the current climate, this might be a good time for a career change, to line those people up with these positions that again are in high demand. So clinics and hospitals are looking for these positions right away. Okay, I have another curveball I'm going to throw at you real quick. Is there a requirement to work in the field you train for after completing the program? Yes, absolutely. Um, so the idea is that, again, you train as medical assistant, you'd be placed right into a position as medical assistant. You train for a nurse assistant program, we'll place you right into that um, position. And you'll be transitioning into the position as an apprentice. So you don't have to feel like, you know, I did this program. Some of them are as little as five weeks. Some of them are a couple months long. You don't have to think, I did this program, and now I need to jump in there and know everything that everyone else on the job already knows. You'll be placed into the job as an apprentice. So at the same pay rate, but you'll have more support from um, the employer and still from KCC during that time as well. You've piqued interest. Where can somebody find out a little bit more information about the program and a list of information sessions? So I'm glad you brought up the information sessions. Information sessions are uh, required in order to participate in this program. And you can find those listed on our website at uh, the main Kapiolani website. If you um, hover over programs of study and click non-credit programs, there are a list of all the programs and their information sessions listed there. When did these programs begin and about how long are each of the programs? So some of the programs are beginning as early as about three weeks from now. Um, some of them don't begin until August. Some of them have multiple sessions. So again, those are all listed on the website, but there are some that are, um, that are shorter, about five weeks. Um, so you can be in and out pretty quickly. Um, and I think it's also important to mention that two of the programs, pharmacy technician and optometry assistant, are 100% offered online. So those programs are available to anyone statewide. The other programs are mostly online, but do have a small in-person component as well. Always nice talking to you, my friend. Good to see you. Stay healthy and safe, and uh, we'll talk again soon. Thank you so much for having us on. And don't have worry, we'll have morning. all that information on our website shortly after the show. Uh, in case you missed it here, we'll have it for you there. Marcus, take care. Aloha. Great opportunity for uh, a for students in a number of different fields to get free training. 
Mm -hmm. And I know parents are just taking it and sharing it with their kids right now. Like, here, take a look at this. I got to say, um, especially in a time where parents may be fearful of sending their kids back off to college mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. and not knowing what the future could hold with the, with the pandemic sure. and every, everybody talking about a second outbreak. Mm -hmm. This is a, a wonderful opportunity for, for someone to stay home and get some free training and maybe just put press a pause button on something else that they were doing uh, in college. I, I think it's great. In a very essential industry as well, too. So, you know, job security there. Yeah. All right.